you guys hear that? It's absolutely pouring out. Nothing like coffee in the morning. Good morning, Pikeys. How are you guys doing today? As you can see, it is very rainy out today. So I'm not sure exactly what we're gonna be getting up to. The guy that's installing the roof is here right now. I think he's just kind of checking to see how it's holding up. But it's not finished, so hopefully he'll get that finished soon. One thing I'm gonna focus on today is emailing some hotels in Valparaiso. That's a city on the coast about two hours west of here. It's a really colorful city. I hear there's a lot of stray dogs there, but I also hear it's like kind of grungy and fun and just interesting. And Francisca and I wanna go and check it out. So I'm hopefully gonna be getting some sort of free stay set up. That's what I'm really hoping for. I hope I can get in contact with someone that's willing to put Francisca and I up for two to four nights so we can explore Valparaiso affordably and film some awesome vlogs with you guys. Fingers crossed for making this happen. Oh yeah, the internet's still down, so I actually can't work on that from here. So maybe we'll be heading over to another library today. At least that means more exploring. I know everybody on this island has a role on this island. So maybe I can roll with mine. Hola, Franny. How are you today? <laughs> so cold. It's a cold day, guys. And we don't have hair dryers, so my hair is wet. <laughs> we're making our way over to the this library, right, Ben? It's a cultural center, but we're going to the library there. Okay. So this is the other library I mentioned. Hopefully, we can get on the internet. Then I can get the vlog uploaded from yesterday because since we don't have internet, I'm still having issues with that. Guys, I know the last couple of vlogs have been kind of basic, just kind of day in the life stuff. But since it's rainy today, that usually means the following day is quite clear smog-wise. So tomorrow we're hoping to head over to Cerro San Cristobal. Yes! Yeah. It's the big hill here. We were just near there the other day where the zoo is. And it gives an amazing view of the downtown, or more like uptown Santiago and the mountain range around here. All, all, all of Santiago. <laughs> Hopefully some drone shots. Yay, we're here! Oh, cool. It's called Centro Cultural Gabriela Mistral. Huh? I would have never been able to say that. Gabriela Mistral <laughs> Cultural Center. See? See. Si. And it was built some years ago after a building set on fire in the same spot. Ah. So they changed everything and they did a cultural center. And now it's made out of metal. Yes, rusty <laughs> metal. And it's all rusted out. <laughs> We are out here right now. I was just headbutted you because we are still out here. It's so cold. No, not stopping us. We got vlogs to upload. Winter as cooming. Okay guys, the library is actually on the other side here. But we came into the building across the way and we're gonna check out some of the galleries quick. What's this, babe? It's a toy in the popular art. We found it. <laughs> These look awesome. These are actually from like the 40s and 50s. Linda. <laughs> Linda Yama? Linda Yama. <laughs> AKA Cute Llama. Mm -hmm. I think it's kind of stupid, but I love to. You love tiny little things? It's like tiny pottery. I do love the tiny little pots as well. I went to a camp when I was younger called Leif Erikson and they had like this whole story that there was little gnomes. I don't know if they called them gnomes, but they had all these little scenes set up around the camp where they had all these little pots where they would like melt BBs in their pans. And this really reminds me of that. They even have this sign. Mui Bacan. These are kind of ugly. Why are you so ugly? Ah, maracas. Do you call them maracas here? Uh, Sonajeros. Sonajeros. I think for the babies. 
a rattle. Oh, it's a baby rattle. Baby rattle. Ah. Mm -hmm. I know. Look at this. And I thought they were maracas. Hey, what are you guys doing? You looking at me? This is my art exhibit. I'll cut you. Babe, he's gonna cut us. Run. Screw you, mister. Guys, these are super cool. Apparently these are toys. Francisca played with them. Hey, you press them at the bottom and the guy bounces. Oh, I wish we could see one in action, but I can imagine you squeeze the bottom and it goes woo woo. We can get one of those, they are still popular. See? Yes. All right. This is clearly the best part of the exhibit. What could be in there? Oh, snakies. <laughs> I had so many of these ones when I was a little. Sa -sa. Babe, mm -hmm. I know homeless people is a bit of an issue in Santiago, but you never told me about the homeless dogs. Perito, you'll be okay. He has food. Should be alright. He looks like he's getting fed well enough. <laughs> we have made it into the library. Guys, I'm talking really quiet because it's actually super quiet in here and there's a lot of people working. But yeah. We're connected to the internet. I'm just exporting my vlog that I'm about to upload, and I'm pretty happy. The bummer is the internet is less than a megabyte upload and download speed, so this upload could take a while. Francisca's sitting right over there working on her stuff as well. We will probably be here for two or three hours, and then we'll catch up with you guys afterwards. Wow, the mountains are super clear right now. Apparently this is really rare here. We had to abort the library and come get food. I have a spinach queso yeah. empanada. And Francisca got a carne queso empanada. Mm. We didn't plan too well with the food. We started getting super hungry. So we're gonna eat these, then we're gonna head back. Oh my God, guys. They have a cappuccino with manjar in it. If you missed it in previous vlogs, Manjar is like a dessert here that is so good. I'm getting one. Salud. Oh yeah, that is really good. Woo! Okay guys, that was a pretty good session at the library there. Didn't contact any hotels just because I was getting like the template figured out for the email, and then I had Francisca do a Spanish version of it just in case that will help. But tomorrow, back at home, hopefully with internet, gonna start contacting hotels, getting manager names, emails, and just start sending those, like a ton of those emails out. Hopefully get some good replies. Wow, look at all that traffic. Wow, look at that baby. <laughs> wow, look at that poppy. <laughs> okay guys, really wacky vlog today, a lot of random stuff, being really goofy. I've actually already cut out all the footage and I'm just here to sign off. I want to give a big shout out to my friend Benin over at Gives a Minute. He's the guy I stayed with in Australia. Recently he took a trip to Fiji where he stayed with four different resorts over the course of a week or two and he managed to book with all of them free of charge. So he did a little video explaining how he managed to do that with less than 500 subscribers. I'll give a link to that video. You guys should go check that out if you're interested in seeing how he managed to do that. Tomorrow, Francisca and I have a pretty fun day planned. We're gonna go to Cerro San Cristobal. That is the massive hill overlooking the city. It's gonna be beautiful, guys. And then we're gonna go to a movie at three o'clock. It's half off tomorrow. I'm so excited. We're gonna see Wonder Woman. And then we're probably gonna get some dinner. It's gonna be kind of like our first official date. We're gonna have fun with it. We're gonna bring you guys with well, I hope you guys enjoyed this wacky vlog. We're gonna get warm here in bed because it's absolutely freezing right now. If you guys enjoyed the vlog, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't because, you know, why not? It's free. <laughs> it's free. And we'll catch you pikeys back here tomorrow. Peace. Thank you, we're gonna die.
<sighs> I don't know, babe. <laughs> what am I doing tonight?